Hey everybody, XCI here. Welcome back to a Blind Let's Play of The Witcher. We are still sort of in tutorial mode, at least I feel like I'm definitely in tutorial mode. I, there's a lot of stuff to soak in. Um, I, the episodes are coming a little slower, just a very quick message here, um, because I'm still trying to get through another game, and I want to focus more um, more of my attention on this game when I get into it, into it. Right now I'm just trying to get through the tutorial stuff slowly but surely. All that's missing is a mage who'd know how to use this. And just get a feel for the game, um, and so I'm gonna. I'm just taking things once in a while. Uh, just taking things slowly, just to see what's up. So we have. Uh, I think I gotta mix something. Uh, I also want to. We got a swallow potion, uh, transfer all. Um, also, I want like weapons and armor. I feel like I missed something. I was I was like cutting the old videos, and I felt like there was like a rack somewhere, and I probably could have grabbed like did I just see one here now. I probably could have grabbed something off of a weapons rack or something in the courtyard. And I didn't do that. They once laid me down here. Okay. Vesemir. As Carol came by while you were resting, Triss is still unconscious go check but stable. Triss. That's a relief. I've made a decision, Wolf. We abandon Care Morin. There's nothing holding us here. I see. We need to bid Leo farewell and wait for Triss to recover. And the bandits? Yes, we need to finish things. But first, we must make a healing potion for Triss. Yes. We'll need to search for ingredients. Yes. Nothing useful left here. I can do that. How do I make the potion? Lambert will give you the formula. I see. Look for him by the fireplace. Got it. He's with our brave sorceress. Lambert? He doesn't hate Triss? Feels guilty, I think. The first thing Trissel hear when she wakes is finally awake, Marigold. That's Lambert. Let's get to work. Later, I'll teach you how to extract ingredients from monsters. I'll be in the main I'm hall. I'm sort of excited about that. Fine. Not gonna lie. I'm like intimidated by it because I feel like it's gonna be a lot to, you know, to just digest. Weird word to use there, but uh, left click on the scroll icon. Uh. Left click on the scroll icon or press J to open the journal. Oh, yeah, that's fine. J is fine. Press quest to see your next. Qu yep. Uh, choose the potion for Triss quest. Left click track quest. New quest. The potion for Triss. I need to see. Okay, let's uh, go to quests. A potion for Triss. Vesemir told me to prepare a potion for Triss, who is wounded. Lambert is watching over the sorceress in the main hall. He'll give me further instructions. I need to see Lambert in the main hall of Kaer Morin and find out how to brew the potion. And uh, show act uh, track quest, which it automatically did for me. Is that something about a scroll bar? Hold on. Defending Kaer Morin, I must explore the fortress, make sure the others are all right. Okay, so there's two. Oh, I see. There's a star right there. Here, let me try. So let me just. Okay, cancel. What? Cancel tracking. But can't that just make you switch it automatically? <laughs> that was weird. A way, weird way to get out of that. But okay. I'm sure there's a button there I was missing here. I'm just messing around here. Give me a sec. I see it's just it was just weird for some reason like now it says I can cancel the tracking but uh, we're good let's check characters locations just looking for anything new no let's move on looking for a green grasses the smell is heady looking for ingredients are these ingredients no I, mean, I guess just just aim for the damn quest right Stop being so explorative. But come on, what if there's like stuff I could miss? <laughs> Damn it. Ooh. Oh, that's where I went for the power, right? The whispering stone. Yeah, let's see if he says anything though. Did I just let's see. Oh. Oh. I could just get it. At oh, wow. 
Art sign intensity increased by 50%. That's my gust of wind thing. Was oh, this like an extra buff? That if you take the time to come and get it, or they're probably all over the land or something, or as you go, I don't know. It's just another random like buffer. It's just it, the, these things are everywhere. Man. Like not these things, but ways to buff your character with. It's just a big mathematical like equation of <laughs> possibilities. Uh, and I, right now, I don't feel like anything is more important than another because of just how broad the you know the options are. This game takes a lot into consideration and just, you know. I'm sure like it's balanced in a way where some things will be harder against X, Y makes something, you know, etc, etc. Okay. Lambert, okay. I can't... <laughs> yeah, let's just quickly go up the stairs here. I just want to see if this is legitimately like I can't do anything because the stairs are broken. Okay. Man, I hope they have a dungeon passage out of here. Alright, Lambert. Lambert. Who's doing a forward moonwalk there? Geralt, is something wrong? No time to talk. I need to make a potion for Triss. You should find a vial of white gull in the armory on the upper floor. Grab some calcium equum from the evening hall. Look for white stones in one of the chests. If you find any stragglers, finish them. We don't need prisoners. The stairs are through that door. I'd go, but Marigold lies unconscious by the fire. Oh. Well, sure, I'll just go... Well, maybe I... I don't want... Where can I get some alcohol? I'm, uh... I took the one talent, right? Where the drinking thing? But here, I'm gonna go with, uh... Something more lore-based first, Lambert, just in case. I have to tell you something. What is it? Leo. The bandits killed him. He wasn't ready. What a loss. We'll hunt them down, Wolf. We'll avenge Leo. Where yeah. can I get some alcohol? Yeah, trick away the there pain. should be white gull in a crate in the armory on the upper floor. The room's full of weapons. You'll know it when you see it. Got a bunch in my pack, actually, but I just want more. I'll find you later. Okay. Um, prepare potions in meditation mode. You do have to go into meditation mode to do a bunch of stuff, huh? So that's, that's pretty cool. It forces you to sort of just take a break and think about the, the non kind of momentum y stuff. I think words all over the place. Gather the required ingredients first. Okay, let's take a look around, huh? Let's go kill some fools who dare get in our way. I should probably consider what potions I'm going to drink if that's about to go down, though. Let's check on Triss, actually. Okay, never mind. What's this thing do? Left click on a lit campfire to enter meditation mode. Okay, okay, okay. No, no, no. I, 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 uh, fuck. <sighs> never mind. Oh, <laughs> the animation's a little slow. Okay, it's not super slow, but it's just. Don't need that right now. Witcher George slaying the dragon. Oh, Witcher George. Oh. Like Saint George, yeah, fight the right? You can see motifs and stuff in art with that with uh, the George the Dragon. Courtyard. Oh, hmm. oh what's this one? Seems witches have always been better with a sword than with a paintbrush. <laughs> Come on, man. Different time paintbrushes weren't even made. Uh, the way they're made today. They're, they're all kind of... I mean, you use whatever you could, man. Pig hair? Horse hair? Horse hair was actually supposedly very good, if I remember correctly. What was it? Pig hair? Pig hair was, like, tough. Like, it was durable brushes. Fine, though. I forget what the fine hair brushes were made out of. Uh, do I want to check outside? I don't need to go outside. So, maybe I need to stick to the quest. Also, blue is a very hard color to make. So paintings with blue pigment were... That's why royalty commissioned a lot of paintings. And norm, uh, generally, paintings commissioned for kings and stuff would have blue paint... Would, would have blue in them. Defending common folk. Inspiring. Yeah, because um, blue is a very hard color to find in nature. Like in pigments, like to pull off uh, natural products and stuff, so... That's why. 
Okay, um, barrel. I always hit E. Flint. Flint is great. I like the flint. What was that? Red means enemy, yeah? Mm hmm. Okay, we'll be right there. Be patient. We have ourselves some fish. Gutted fish. I should probably read these a little bit just once at least. Restore vitality. Could also be sold. Vitality. So food is just vitality generally, all the same, right? Just different different products. It's probably gonna make them make a stacking nightmare, aka not. <laughs> not stackable. Oh chicken. Sure, I'll take the chicken. Restores vitality and it's just food. Uh, I wonder how uh, pack space works in this. That, that's also curious. Let's do a quick save here. Just in case I'm a little rusty. There he comes. Uh, also, I needed to drink some potions, which I did not do. Die, bastard! Uh, I don't want to be that one. I want to be this one. You look kind of thievy. Mess with me and die. Bitch. Oh, Time to die. dude, I got this. Hey, hey. We're cool. Let me avenge. Oh, I switched to Griffin by accident. Oh, I see. Cute. I thought Seed switched to Griffin before in last episode. And I was wondering, like, how do I just get this one button to cycle through? Oh. C does go to Griffin mode. And Zed Z goes to Wolf. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. I see. I see. Oh, that's pretty good. Okay, I like that you can just toggle, but I also like that if I just move down to Z, X, C. Sorry, I'm from Canada. Okay. <laughs> see, sometimes I try to stick to American in my spelling and writing because I work for an American company for over a decade, blah, 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 blah. Doesn't matter. But, uh, uh, so I've conditioned myself, but sometimes I'll slip it into Canadian English. Okay, so Z is Z is wolf. X is a uh, cat. In, in C is Griffin. Cool. Let's stick to heavy right now because I believe that's where my talents are put. So if I can keep them on heavy, I will. I mean, Griffin probably worked out there because there were two guys around me at one point. So probably worked out. I think I saw the, another red eye. Way over there. Oh, 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 you're like I thought I saw blue. So I thought it was uh, my dude. See again, like see how I'm like hitting, but mm, something's still weird there. Oh, I see. You get areas and max straight up though if you can do that. Oh, son, Jesus! Oh my God! Oh, is that does that is that power right there because of one of my talents or something? Holy hell! I like. Oh, did I? I didn't. I don't think I looted because I was. I was of course hitting E to try to loot the guys downstairs. <laughs> Oops. Awkward. Where are you going? Why are you walking that way? I asked you to click over there, man. All right. Where's the other dude? Blood stain. Damn it! Come on, dude. Can't you see I'm looting? Mess with me and die. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, oh, oh yeah! Where? Wait, eh. Come on, turn around, Carol. Okay, I like this move because the as soon as I land it, my my sword turns yellow, and I like that because it means I can sort of time it more effectively. I like it. The little the weird swingy dancing ones are, are sort of throwing me off. There's always like a way for me not to have to move down to go and grab that stuff. I could just hit a button and it would like spam it faster. Uh, remains. Finish your job of looting, Geralt. Use all the coins we can get. Let's check the room. Great. Oh, I had to come upstairs to the armory to go to grab something too, right? Unknown potion. Double click or drip. Oh, I can double click or drip. Yeah, but this is the best one. Uh, but how do I know it? I have to use it in order to know what it does. <laughs> how about I don't do that right now? Um, but you know what, I really should, if I'm going to take anything down right now, I need to... <gasps> Let's drink some alcohol on our next fight and see how that works. 
Um, swallow. I've got four. Uh, thanks for reminding me. That I don't just take vi this po swallow in order to just heal. It just heals over time, which means you need to do this before a fight. So it works kind of like every other potion. Things that happen in like these like incremental bits. Damn, I just want more friggin' items, man. Quest items. Oh, it'll, that's cool, that little segment out here. Now, why does this split by a row here? Like, why do you... Why is there three tiers here? A little bit. Sort and stack all items. Oh, my gosh. That's freaking awesome. Like, what? Potions for... Like, potions and beers and... Oh, wow. That's cool. Um... So I guess I got three shot satchels. Okay, let's no, let's not do the beery right now. Let's let's move on. I'll get a shot. I'll get a shot. I see this is a bedroom. Stairs to, stairs to Triss's room. Dresser. What do we got? Bottled water. Drink for what? Vitality two. Endurance. Okay. I love this, man. Again, it shows a little bit of its age, but it's okay. I mean, I'm getting used to the controls. Are are depth? They definitely feel a little bit wonky, but I I'm, I'm already sort of feeling I'm feeling the flow of it. Like this is a, a little bit spastic, and I'm at one. I'm at the lowest setting. It feels a little bit off to me, but I think I'll adapt. I, I think it's adaptable at this point. So bread. Goat's milk, mutton. I forget how I used to pronounce that word, mutton. I think it's mutton. I don't know if I used to say mutton. I don't even know, but I don't think I pronounced it right at one point. Um, let's not. Let's keep at this floor right here, shall we? Let's be thorough. Let's get some alcohol in the blood here. Where, where, this bitch right here? Here. Well, let's check this barrel first. Maybe there's some beer in it. Oh, I thought it was another unknown. Okay, now let's let's do this. Boom. Right click to use. Sorry. Click, 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 click. Alright. I'm just going to go for this dude now. Actually, you know what? I'm going to go strong here, even though I know that that's probably not the best. But that's where I got the power move. Is he actually doing less damage to this bandit, bandit because he is agile? No way. Hold on. I mean, that's where all my benefits are, though. Okay. Are you blocking me? Like, why is my sword doing this? Like, this is the part I hate. I'm not gonna lie. Like, what, what is happening right now? Okay, Jesus Christ. Like, why is my swing not happening there? What is happening? I'm a wolf. Oh, for real? Was that happening because you need to have a certain fighting style to, to finally get through certain enemies that require that style to be defeated? No way. Come on, I just want to power up one thing my power attack tip turn off floating messages like too fast and nah I'm okay whatever that's fine oh I might have just been failing because of the alcohol maybe I might have been compromising myself we might do this running how am I, how am I running Why, how am I moving this fast I don't mind it because it gets me to do this faster what's this thing the Frightener book. The book discusses Frighteners. Oh, is that how you get codexes? I mean, that's how the other ga games, I, I guess, suppose do that. Oh, am I going to lose my running capabilities there? Shoot. Shoot. There we go. Did it just seem like he was running faster? Anyways, uh, I've missed a room back here. Let me just uh, get this room right here. That's a mice door. Oh. Oof. I, <laughs> a precarious place to sleep, man. Jeez Louise. I see a red thing. So I know where I need to go, but... I wonder if does this thing detect enemies behind walls and stuff, or is that eventually going to open up as a potential power, etc., etc. I'm also seeing a lot of raw food, which makes me think that I got to cook it or something at some point. I mean, that's a weird way to just get into a room, but okay. <laughs> We're done here. Totally precarious, okay. 
Am I going the right way now? I'm a little bit. I may have disoriented myself. I think I'm good. We have calcium. Oh, I do like how it's expli it explicitly tells you where, where you need to go um, to get stuff. It just... What the hell though? Wasn't I in here? <laughs> I absolutely was in here. Was I not in here? But I, I don't think I got <laughs> the quest item. Oh, what? Maybe I, I don't know. Was I? What the hell? <laughs> okay, quest. Uh, journal. Quest. A potion of Triss. I kill the bandits. I disposed of all the bandits who were still inside Kaer Morin. That possibly puts an end to the attack. I don't think so, man. I think I see a red... That might be a quest arrow, but... Let, let's, uh... I also didn't see, like, a notification up in, up here for the alcohol that I drank. I might have missed it. If it was somewhere else, I might have missed it, but... Sweet Monstrum. Or a portrayal of witchers. An anti-witcher pamphlet describes how ordinary people perceive witchers and recounts the story of Kermora's destruction. I can't wait. I love this potion thing. I've got white gull. Alchemical base used. Yep. Yeah. Um, I'm going to wait to see if there's something that allows me to identify. Thank you. I like. I don't know what that is going to mean. This weapon cannot be used in combination with... Huh. Well, that's... Uh, just because I feel, I feel it feels good to do it that way. Inventory full. You don't say. How do I get... Oh. Oh, is the backpack... Is this like some sort of thing where like you upgrade this so that then it maybe joins so you can put these longer? These three high can go into a three high pack, but right now I don't have a pack that's three high. So I can't take something that's three high? Hmm. Sort of interesting, sort of... Um, no, actually, I want to see what that does. Five to 15. This weapon cannot be used in combination with the Witcher combat styles. So different styles pull out different weapons. used in Witcher combat styles. Okay, well. I'll be right there, random. Are you a random person? Who are you? Are you just a dummy? Oh, you're a dummy. Dummy. Okay. I guess we're done here. It's got a dagger in it. I wish I could take it so I could sell it for some money. And this will tell you you're all done done. Oh, that's cool too, if it tells you that. Because you're marking the quest or something pretty cool I sort of want to see if I can leave this place and fight above but <laughs> maybe I should just stay on track how about that yeah how about that let's let's go there's a guy here I can still take something from right or do they despawn the bodies remains they turn into skull skull and, and bones great as long as you don't take my my loot my loot option away from me, I'm happy. Uh, wait. So this is Lamb. Okay, so he's going to now tell us how to do this. Let's just. Uh, I've done all Lambert asked. I should talk to him. Uh, I'm going to talk to some random dudes though. Here, I haven't talked to Askel. Tell him about uh, Leo. Need anything, Wolf? I have some questions. What is it? Whoa. What do I use as the base for my potion? You see, you seem to feel at home you here. You seem to feel at home here. Or I'll just say what Well, I've repeat. always preferred an armory to a lab. Though Vesemir plays up the importance of potions, he's hardly an expert. After all, he's always taught swordplay. Still, he tries to teach us everything he learned when he was young, and that was a while back. But to be honest, I don't care for all these powders, mushrooms, and other trash. Oh, they gray out the option. I love it already. Couldn't Triss have helped with Leo's mutation? 
Maybe it's a little more complicated than that. See, we've never shown her the lab, and the last mutation was completed years ago, before the battle. Vesemir can tell you more. Mutations that then make the witchers. I think I understand that correctly. <laughs> you really think Triss never used magic to peek inside? She respects our secrets, and she's done a lot for us. For you. I trust her. So why haven't you shown her the lab? Triss would like to use our secrets to heal people and such. I've no doubt she'd try, but it's never that simple. Ever heard of the gnome Alfred Nabel? Eskel, I have amnesia. An incomparable inventor, like most of his race. Through years of research, Legit? he discovered yeah, an amazing those. substance. He intended it for use in mines and quarries. Though a genius, Alfred failed to foresee his invention's possible applications. Others quickly realized that a substance designed to rip granite from the ground could destroy castle walls. Some even considered using it in open battle. I get it. So what happened to Alfred's discovery? Mages stopped it from spreading. Alfred committed suicide, and his lab burned down. Good lord, man. Oh, I didn't go gray. Come on, man. Tell me about the trial of the grasses. It's a three-stage process. The first is the choice. Leo completed it, enduring the hard training and diet. I presume it's more than your basic lettuce and carrots. Special mushrooms, mosses, and herbs are grown in the lab. Combined with training, they accelerate muscle growth and digestion, improving the body's general condition. Does everyone pass the first stage? Unfortunately not. The liver and heart often fail, and the mind sometimes too. Resulting in excessive aggression. What's the second stage? The trial of the grasses. More idiotic tales have been conjured up about that than about princesses and dwarves. Before the raid, the lab contained vials, hearths, formulae, herbs, and the grasses. A mage and his magic were all that was lacking. Did you ever witness a trial? Just one. This is coming up, actually. A little bit. I thought I was going to lose it when your hair turned white. The grasses affect the nervous system, so magic must control the process. The trial results in lightning fast reflexes, reaction times normal people will never attain. Only four out of ten survive. Man, oh man. Uh, I'm wondering like how this came up, like because I've got amnesia, so like what what entices me to ask him this? I don't recall anything that would trigger that. Quite a cut. And the I'm last curious, stage, player, that's why I don't know the specifics. It involves changes like the mutation of the eyes, me. the bone marrow, hormones. In exchange, Anyways, we see in the dark, heal much faster than ordinary folk, and gain increased resistance to poison. Interesting. What's the cost? We're infertile. Your humanity. The changes oh. are irreversible. Entirely. Did you see the magic storm? Yes, I was out hunting. Just before the storm came, a swarm of night jars took flight. Hundreds of them. Magic gray storm. streaks across the sky, trilling wildly. Usually less of them gather, and their cries really sound so desperate. When the storm came, I gave up the hunt and headed toward Kaer Morin. Met the others on the way. Am I missing something? Is this part of the books I've been picking up? That one went gray, though. See, why didn't these go gray? What do I use as the base for my potion? Alcohol. The better it is, the purer and more powerful your potion. I hope I didn't drink it. Why do these stay blue? Couldn't Triss have helped with Leo's mutation? Maybe. It's a little more complicated than that. See, we've never Shoot, shown I her the lab. I can't this. I can't. Okay, I'll talk to Vesemir. Let's right click out of it. All right. Um, courtyard door. Don't be foolish. Let's go talk to Vesemir. Uh, let's go talk to... Let's talk to Vesemir first, then let Bear. Oh, that was a tough fight. And then read the code. I want to read that. I found first. a few intruders upstairs, but... I understand they won't be a problem. Lambert, however, let the Frightener get to him. Nothing serious. Good you went after Triss and handled that mage. She was able to salvage some equipment, but it looks like the main device has vanished. Our beautiful sorceress was right, I know. You did well, Wolf. Take this High armor five. and sword. I've been keeping them for you. 
Yes. Finally, more gear. Are there other witchers? There were three witcher schools in all, but it's been long since I've heard word of the other two. You've met Did all you... the witchers I know of, except for Berengar. Did I know him? I don't believe so. An introvert, he chose his own path. Actually, none here can say they know Berengar. He often ran away from Kaer Morhen, though he would always return in the end. After the trial of the grasses, he finally accepted his destiny and started training for real. Why isn't he here? I don't know. We lost touch with him a while back. Should we be worried? Should we be worried? Should we be worried? Can I ask you something? Of course. Who was Leo? One of hundreds of orphans of the war with Nilfgaard. I apprenticed him six years ago. I'm sorry. We'll recover our secrets and find Leo's murderers, even if they fled to the end of the world. Can I ask you something? Of course. You mentioned defending Kaer Morhen before. Yes. Fifteen witchers once lived here, training boys for their trials. Only they knew the secrets of mutation. Witchers who set out on the path and failed to assimilate among humans wintered here. Before the battle, twenty-three witches and forty students called Kaer Morhen home. Too damn few for the mob that attacked. I never knew why they came. Some say a sudden explosion of anger born of disdain for witches. But no. Someone provoked the mob with flyers filled with lies. Special agents read them to the peasants. Truer still, the fanatics could never have taken the fort without the aid of sorcerers, though they outnumbered us by far. They didn't even spare the youngest. I alone survived, concealed among the corpses. Walk around, Wolf. The skeletons remain. You may find a flyer. There used to be hundreds. Memorize it as a warning of the evil humans can perpetrate. You're, you're a human, though. I think you're talking broadly, but it's... Can I ask you something? Of course. So it's like a political sort of thing that went down to, like, screw over the witchers at one point. Okay, Any so. idea who attacked? No, but the mage suggests no ordinary bandits. We found pins adorned with salamanders on the dead. The symbol of their organization, perhaps? Uh -huh. I sense hard times ahead. All right, we'll speak so later. So with that, let's go into our journal. New quest, Berengar's secret. And we got, okay. Oh, face and shadows. Vesemir mentioned a witcher who had left Kaer Morhen before my arrival. His name is Berengar. Seemed a little too important, but okay, we got quests here. Um... My Kaer Morhen companions and I are not only remaining are are not the only remaining witchers. Apparently, Berengar is also still alive. He stays away from the Brotherhood and wasn't at the fortress when it was attacked. Where was he then? And who is he? If I ever meet him, I'll be certain to ask at least one of those questions before you murder him. Uh, I don't know about murder, but I'm. That's that's sounds like a setup for a uh, sort of a betrayal plot right there for sure. Uh, but why I don't know. Vesemir, blah blah blah. And then potion for Triss. We're still on this. Let's go. Characters locate okay. monsters. Oh, I thought I got like books for this crap. Give me some monster books, man. Uh, White Gull. Uh, White Gull is a mild hallucinogen which provides pleasure during the long nights which are spent at their fortresses, waiting out the winter. The witchers make this potion using secret saprophytes grown in the dungeons of Kaer Morhen, but it can also be made from commonly available ingredients. Vitrol, vitrol. I don't know what that means right now, but I see these are components to make these things. <laughs> oh god. Not even under the glossary? Where are my books at? Oh, basic alchemy. Prepare potions and, okay, under, while meditating. Campfires also allow you to meditate. I'm confused. Then, let's go into my equipment inventory. Where are, there, these. 
Oh, right click to read. Dumbass. Here, let's uh, do that right there. Thank you. Let's read the Monstrum. It's going to be long. Monstrum, or Portrayal of Witchers. Anonymous writer. Indeed, there is nothing more repulsive than these monsters that defy nature and are known by the name of Witcher, as they are the offspring of foul sorcery and witchcraft. They are unscrupulous scoundrels without conscience and virtue. I doubt that. Veritable creatures from hell, capable only of taking lives. They have no place among decent and honest folks. Or oh, is this a flyer that was going around? And this care more where these villains nest and practice foul rituals must be wiped off the face of the earth and all evil traces of it need to be treated with salt and salt peter. Is salt peter? Salt peter? Salt peter? Uh, to complete the deed. This book has a glossary entry to the journal. I see. You got to hit the book, then it has a glossary entry. Does it add more to set glossary entry? Uh, let's read this one as well. How do I get out of this? I have to hit escape. Oh, close. Okay, let's check this one too. The Frightener, a collection of information on the unusually rare monster known as the Frightener. This book, uh, this book adds a bestiary. Bestiary. Entry to the journal, close, uh, journal, glossary. Due to their, uh, due to their otherness, unusual abilities and magic skills, witches are treated as outcasts and sometimes even met with hatred. This hatred was made manifest during the infamous attack on Kaer Morhen, which led to the destruction of the fortress and the death of most of the witchers wintering there. Those who survived are doomed to extinction since they no longer train successors. People need witchers but are simultaneously afraid of them. The itinerant, the itinerant warrior inspire fear because they are mutants and have superhuman powers. A witcher is ready to welcome guests and contacts with members of this profession are almost always limited to business. Witchers are invariably attacked during pogroms has a pogrom and social upheavals directed against those who deal in magic cool frighteners occurrence frighteners are very rare they come into being as a result of magical experiments to create a frightener a mage has to possess great power and a basic knowledge of mutation Immunity. Frighteners are immune to almost all effects. Susceptibility. Sensitive to steel and silver. Very sensitive to loud sounds at high frequencies. Interesting. So different monsters that will just tell you what the, the weaknesses and stuff are. That's pretty cool. Like I said, it's all a big like equation. This game feels like a massive equation of possibilities. Tactics. In combat, frighteners rely on their size and strength. They try to knock their opponents down and then deal a lethal blow. I can also do that. Alchemy, Frightener's Eye and Claw. The first mage to create a Frightener was the infamous renegade Dagobert Sula, a diligent student of the Zeracanian masses of alchemy and the supervisor of Trial of the Grasses carried out at Kermorn. Upon beholding the abomination he had created, Sula is said to have cried, What have I done? He destroyed the monster his notes however survived i see and then the one mysterious mage because i one part i'm like is that sold out there okay no it's, the notes got taken so an interesting setup there because you got to find the books the books create the have their own information within the context of the game and then you add them to the codex type of thing and then you sort of get meta knowledge with game knowledge it's a couple interesting way to do it Okay, let's let's just push the Lambert thing along as well. What do you need? Try to wrap this one up. I have Done. all the ingredients. Ooh, they have good the there. And it's safe upstairs. Good. You'll need two more things to make the potion. Damn it, Lambert. The claw of a mighty beast and some celandine. Vesemir will tell you where to find them. Let me teach you the formula. I was ready to go, man. Um, new entry. New entry. Formula. Potion. I suspect I'm going to have to come in here quite a bit. Effects. The potion is intended for tr Triss and has no other use. Okay. Uh, potion is blah, blah, blah. Okay. Immediate. Talk. So this is plot item, essentially. According to Lambert's instructions, a potion for the unconscious sorcerer's Triss can be made of a Celadine, a Frightener's Claw, and a Suant, Suant mushroom. Though calcium, blah, blah, blah. 
Oh, it can replace the ingredient. Okay. Uh, once gathered, the components should be mixed uh, with white gold. Okay, so it looks like we have what we need. Uh, there was something else they said that was added. Calendine? Nah, common plant. Probably in a quest here. I need to speak with Vesemir. You know what? Sure, let, 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 let's talk. To oh. Is that because I dropped it? <laughs> yes. Uh, inventory. Let's check our gear. Damage received, 85%. More math. Great. This is still... I'm guessing your, your powers bring those out. So, Vesemir. Oh, where did you go, Vesemir? What the hell? It's telling me to go this way, but I don't see no Vesemir. Vesemir? Vesemir? I could... You know what? I'm going to end this episode by... Oh, there's Vesemir. I was going to take a fireplace, uh, just a little break there, and, and see if we got talents and stuff. We should probably do that, because I seem to take a long thinking my way through that. Stay, Vesemir! Yes? Lambert gave me the formula. I, like that the I take it you out. already have white gall and calcium equum. I do. What next? You'll need Celandine. Take what I have. Plus Perfect. the claw of a monster like the Frightener. To skin the creature, take a sharp knife and cut along the torso. You'll find the Frightener's carcass oh. in the upper oh, courtyard. Once you've extracted the claw, rest by the fire while making the potion. Got it. Well, you know what? How about we do that potion update? Okay, let's click on the fire. I want to check on talent. Oh, jeez. Oh, I like that. Hey, hands off, hands off. Pathfinding is decent as long as you get me there. You're going the long way, dude. Okay, I was just giving you some cra I was gonna say something nice. Okay, let's go in here. Left click on the vial to create the potion. I I don't want I well first I don't see a vial. Second, I don't oh there's your weapon switches right there. Second, I don't want to create a potion. I want to do... Is it here? Yeah, it is. Ah, uh, zero talents. <laughs> Alright, then. Do I go here? Select the formula to add... Oh, my God. Select the formula to add ingredients to the vial automatically. Then left-click on the mix at the bottom right of the screen. Right here. Ah... Uh, Will you tell me what's possible? White gall. I should be messing with this, I don't think. Oh, I see. Hold on. No, I don't see. How do I... I want... So... I see a base slot. Are these, sir? Oh my god, Vitrol. But I mean. Ah, ah. Ah. Okay, the color there. See, why has this got an X on it, though? Like, this was a solid blue. This has got an X, but I'm, I'm like two Vitrols. And then a Rubis. Oh, that's cool, man. So I could always make another one, but I, I should probably not push this just in case I ruin something I got two of these but I just wanted to see more or less how it worked um, I'm good with that uh, let's check this stuff oh, I did have detect so uh, I'll figure that one out okay map alchemy system nope um, and I think I'm good journal is the last thing we can do here Okay, I'm good. I'm good right here. Let's let's back up out of here. Do a zero minuter. <laughs> and I'm get, uh, next episode we'll go to the courtyard. We'll go and uh, deal with that carcass. Get the last supplies. Bring Tris out of this. I will catch you in the next episode. Don't forget to explore. Guys, inspire everybody. Peace.